scooter today in the hopes that I will ride it around during lunch. I don't do tricks, so don't expect that. I just cruise around, that's it. That's it. It's fun. It reminds me of a time when I was a kid and my dad made me a scooter out of wood. And he put reflectors all over it. He painted it. He put streamers on it. He bedazzled it with jewelry and stuff. Like he put little jewels and stuff everywhere. It was, it was quite the scooter, man. It was quite the scooter. And then, like, you know, many, 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 many years later, scooters emerged again out of the darks and depths of nowhere. And, you know, they made them with inline wheels, but it's all good. Mine was made out of old roller skate wheels. Like, I'm talking steel wheels, you know what I mean? Like, the wheels that were, like, you had to push it hard. They were like old roller skates that you strapped on your shoes. I don't know where he got those from. Maybe those were his. I don't know. I never did ask. So I'm on my way to work and this time I'm going to get there early. I'm going to get there on time and I'm going to beat the Fonz. We got a new kid working there at the office and I call him the Fonz because he, he wears like a leather jacket all day long, a brown leather jacket all day long. It's not that cold in the office. Maybe that's just his style. I don't know. But ever since he started working there, the fucker's been taking my spot. And we don't have assigned spots. We don't. And I have pretty much parked in every single place that you can imagine almost in the fucking parking lot and so yeah I've found this perfect space where all I do is just come into the drive and I just pull straight into it I don't have to turn I don't have to do nothing fancy you just pull straight into it it's a straight shot and I've been getting there late so he's been taking my spot away I don't want to be rude. I don't want to go up to the kid and say, listen, don't park there. Listen, that's, you know, that's my spot. Park somewhere else. Someone did that to me when I first started working there, and I didn't think that was cool. So I don't want to do that. But I want my spot back, man. And the only way I can get it is to get there on time or early. And that's what I've been trying to do. I'll see you later. It's way too hot, man. It's way too hot. I'm crazy. But I don't know if I'm not crazy. I don't know if I'm going to do the scooter thing, man. I don't know. I don't really know. Yeah, it's an um, unboxing video that I did two months ago. Don't hate me because my life is crazy. It was supposed to be uploaded two months ago, but um, yeah, it never happened. So. so I'm uploading it now, better late than never. I'm unboxing around square Begley stuff, so you'll see that. That'll probably be, that'll be up before this video is up. For your viewing pleasure, you get to see me opening the package. <clears throat> I may not be the best.
best at opening a package, but I like to use my my charm when I do it. If you want me to open more and do more unboxings, then you need to send me stuff, man. Yeah. I give you my address, but then you'd know where I live. Somebody already figured that one out a well while back. And I didn't think that was cool. Thank <laughs> you. 